one for now. Um, find k such that the second equation is the tangent line. Meaning, I want this equation to be the tangent line of this equation. So, my first step in this kind of problem would be if they if this is going to be the tangent line of this, what's going to be the slope of my tangent line? Negative 4, right? So, watch this. If I take f, what's f prime going to be? Well, what's the derivative of a constant? It's kind of weird. It's going to get used to that. Derivative of k, which is a number. What's the derivative of a number? Zero. And what's the derivative of this? Negative 2x. Okay. So I derived this original equation. Now, what do I want my derivative equaling? Well, what was the slope? What's the slope here? Is it m negative 4 for my tangent line? So do I want to find out where my derivative equals negative 4? I dropped the 0. Do I want to find out where my derivative my slope is negative 4. And what we're figuring out here, you divide by negative 2, you find out at x equals 2, you have a derivative of negative 4. Are we okay so far? Now, if this is a tangent line of this, does this coordinate have to also be existing for this graph? This, the coordinate. Let me just kind of show you, and you'll kind of make sense of it. If I have the equation y equals negative 4x plus 7, I'm going to plug that 2 in. Plug the 2 in. Negative 8 plus 7. So y equals negative 1. So my coordinate is 2, negative 1. 2, negative 1 is a coordinate for this graph, correct? Doesn't this graph at this point, this graph always has a slope of negative 4, correct? This graph up here has, we want to find out where this derivative has a slope of negative 4, and we found that as x. So basically, if I know I have 2, negative 1. Can I plug this in to this to find k? Because this coordinate exists for this point. Shouldn't it also exist for this if they're connected? So basically, it's kind of weird. I'm kind of describing it kind of funky. But basically, you now take the original equation right here, and you go negative 1 equals k minus 2 squared. You just plug my x and y in. So that gives me, ends up with negative 1 equals k minus 4. So it looks like k equals 3. What does all that mean? If I took k, put a 3 here. Got it? If I graph this graph, 3 minus x squared. This line would be the tangent line to this graph at some point. Okay? There so it's it's kind of weird to type sometimes get used to. It's probably the more complicated type problem.